this could be your house. You drive me nuts. Your family. And something is about to happen to them. They're here. That could happen to you. Poltergeist. It knows where you live, and it knows what scares you. Poltergeist. A Steven Spielberg production. Rated PG. Hello, fellow followers. Welcome back to Fan Scene. Greg here, and today I have for you, they're here, my 4K movie review of Poltergeist. Uh, this is a great flick from 1982, the original Poltergeist. I love this movie. This movie still holds up to this day. It's still scary. Uh, when I was watching it, I got scared still. it was. It's still that good of a movie. Directed by Toby Hooper and uh, ex executive produced by Steven Spielberg. And for the record, I want to give this a Toby Hooper directed this film. Not Steven Spielberg. Toby Hooper directed this film. But regardless, uh, this is still a crappy cover. If you I'll give you guys a look here, I'm trying not to get the glare because it is shiny. This is a crappy cover. I would have much preferred this cover right here. This is the Blu-ray right here, the original Blu-ray. I would much prefer that cover art. It's the classic poster art. Much better than this. This just doesn't invoke Poltergeist to me. Uh, much like the Lost Boys uh, cover was horrible. Uh, just just bad. But anyways, here's, here's the front of this. And then we got the back with little Carol Ann up there, uh, and all the goodies there. It's just, it was just a good movie, and you know, this take the slip off, uh, you know, and it's pretty much the same, same crappy cover. Uh, great movie though, a really great movie. I don't think I can gush about this transfer as much as I did the Lost Boys transfer. The Lost Boys transfer was beautiful. Uh, I it, like breathed new life in that movie for me. It, like it gave me much more excitement watching it than I've ever had. Uh, this I, I had a good amount of excitement watching. Like I said, I really did get scared again watching this, especially you know by myself at dark it, with the lights turned down. And that's how you watch movies, right? You watch movies with the lights turned down. Uh, you you don't have all the lights on you. You, you you know you get comfortable and I was you know I had it on the screen the 4k the sound everything and it was awesome it was a great experience and it did scare me uh, the transfer I'm not like a like I, I can't explain everything because I don't know like the full details of like when they scan and transfer and everything but as far as I can see with my eyes the, this had some really great standout popping, eye popping moments, especially when it's of a day in the in natural light or like the scene when the guy pills his face off. That was really played really great in 4K. The hallway scene when it stretched out and Joe Beth Williams' uh, mother, you know, she she had to run down the hallway to save her kids. The closet with the light, all that really popped. The the darkness is dark and rich. The faces are great. Uh, Zelda, you know, this house is clean. Uh, that, she's great. It's awesome. That all looks great. But there's certain scenes that just fall a little flat and it's a little dark. But 4K by nature are darker than Blu-rays, but it's a little dark. But it's a great transfer. It looks way, way better than this Blu-ray right here. This Blu-ray des desperately needed an upgrade to 4K or a better transfer. And this is great transfer. I think this is probably the best transfer we will ever get of Poltergeist. And it's well worth it. I, I don't want you guys to think I'm... It's well, well worth this transfer. It, it Just a beautiful, scary... Great movie. The 80s, I love the, the, you know, the 80s looking back. I love 80s horror. Uh, you know, I love talking 80s horror. And it's so great to see so many great 80s horror movies on 4K and to have this, this movie. It was just amazing. If you don't know uh, about Poltergeist, a little bit of spoiler alert here. It's essentially about this family, Joe Beth Williams, Craig T. Nelson. They're three kids. They're living in like the small suburban California, like little uh, suburb. And it's just like peaceful. It's very, very like on a level surface looks looks great. Like it's like a place you want to live. However, their house is taken over by a poltergeist and their little daughter Carol Ann is taken in by these poltergeists, gets sucked into the portal through her closet and they spend a lot of the movie trying to find her. They hire, you know, paranormal investigators. That's when, uh, you know, the Zelda uh, comes in and she, she helps guide them and gives back. But however, it's not done. You find out that their the whole suburb and their house was actually built on top of a cemetery because... James Karen's character, who I love, who was also in Return of the Living Dead, great, great character actor. Uh, you know, he's just, uh, just like greedy, snaky, uh, uh, 
real estate tycoon and he d just moved to headstones and built up the suburb over top of this graveyard and, and the poltergeists are pissed and like there's this, like this one entity and like when the head pops out of the closet when they send in uh joe beth williams character to get carol in that that scene popped but yeah that's essentially the story and all everybody plays their parts beautifully in this it's a great movie the special features on this uh, include they are here the real world of poltergeist documentary in two parts uh Science of the Spirits and Communing with the Dead, which is also the same special features on this, but this Blu-ray, because all the special features are on the Blu-ray, um, and the movie alone has just the 4K. The 4K disc is just on 4K, which is the movie. Uh, it, this also contains the making of Poltergeist, which is uh, like an archival uh, feature and the theatrical trailer, which it contains a little more than that, but it's pretty bare bones on special features. Uh, however, this... This just was, this it was a great movie. It's just, I can't get over the, how great the movie still is today because it holds up perfectly today. If you're looking for something to scare you and get you into that mood heading into October, uh, which I seem to be covering a lot of these on here because I love covering this. I love covering 80s horror and horror stuff like this. Um, this will get you right into that mood for October spooky season and get you scared. If you've never seen it, now would be a great time to see it. If you uh, haven't seen it in a long time, now would be a great time to watch it again. If you're looking to pick up 4K, I do recommend a 4K. I do recommend 4K. It's better than the Blu-ray, way better than Blu-ray. The only real issue I had with this was the audio. The audio is not so great on this. Uh, sometimes when they're talking, it's really soft. You can't un you can't hear them. Uh, so I had to turn it up uh, pretty loud, you know, with my system and everything. Um, but yeah, other than that, the picture looks great. There's just like a few hits and misses here where it didn't quite look like it came from the original camera negative on the 4K scan. Uh, the audio issues was like my biggest problem. Uh, it just it felt like some of the dialogue was just too soft. Like, uh, the, it just, that was just like my biggest problem. But if you've not seen it, see it, check it out. You want to get it. Been debating whether you should buy the 4K. And if you want to upgrade to 4K, I would do it. Uh, but if you're fine with your Blu-ray, that's okay. I think you can stay with your Blu-ray. I think that would be okay. But I, I recommend this 4K. I, like I said, I just can't gush about it like I did the Lost Boys 4K, which I thought that was a mag magnificent 4K transfer. That one I highly recommend. And if you're looking to get in 4K, buy that one and buy this one while you're at it too, because even though it may not be as good as the four, Lost Boys 4K, this is a really great transfer. And uh, just to see a movie like this look so beautiful today in, in 4K, uh, it's it's amazing. I loved it. I loved every minute of it. Of it. And uh, yeah, check it out. Go pick you up Poltergeist. Uh, let me know what you guys think about all this in the comment section down below. Did you pick up Poltergeist? And if you like what you saw here, please hit that like button. Subscribe. Hit that bell for notifications. Consider joining and becoming a channel member. Like I said, leave me those comments. Let me know what you think about this movie, this 4K transfer. Uh, did you pick it up? Did you not pick it up? Are you going to pass on it? Let me know all that. Share this video out for everybody to see. I thank you guys for watching. Please always support physical media. It is the superior format. Wherever you guys are, please have a great, safe, happy, healthy day, morning, afternoon, evening, and night. Godspeed.